This is the LED Matrix t-shirt run by an Arduino lily pad with an interactive LED Matrix screen underneath this uh, silver edging here. You can see it consists of a fabric panel attached to a t-shirt. Um, the back side of the fabric panel contains the LEDs and the wiring and the lily pad. On this side uh, is the joystick and you can start it up by turning to the power switch just inside here, turning it on, and it has a menu, the top level of which displays the options for four different games. The first is Pong, you see P-O-N-G, and you see a bit of ghosting on this video. That's an artifact of the video um, camera, not the LED matrix itself. All right, so the top four level games are Pong, and you can actually click over to the next game with the joystick. The next option is P2, which is interactive Pong, human versus computer. The next option is an interactive game called Ask. I'll show you that one in a little bit. And finally, we have recreated the original cell phone game Snake that many people probably played a long time ago with their, with their cell phones. So you can take a look. The first, go back to Pong, the joystick. If we then click on our selection, try it again. You can see this is the computer playing itself. You see the ball bounces along the edges of the matrix and the paddle just goes up and down to match the ball, so there's no missing. And again, the ghosting is an artifact of the video camera, not of the shirt. So to get back to the top level menu, we click the joystick, and then let's go to the next option, P2, which is interactive pong. Click on that. So I actually have to move the joystick, oh, and if you miss, you see the screen goes funny. I actually have to move the paddle up and down to hit the ball. I seem to be missing more often than hitting. There we go. So, and then we can go back up to the main screen and go to the next option, which is ask. Oh, no, we got back to P2. The next option is ask. If we click on the ask option, It should say, ask me anything, ask me a question. And then you can ask a question, and depending on whether I click the joystick to the left or the right, it will say yes or no. So, is this shirt cool? Ha, I clicked the wrong direction, I got no, let's try that again. Is this shirt cool? Click it to the right. Yes. All right, now I have to click twice to get back up to the top level menu. Once, twice. Okay, we're back to Pong, P2. Ask, and the final option is Snake, just like you played on your cell phone when you were younger. See, there's an elect a digital snake crawling across the screen. You can make it go up, sideways with the down with the mouse, and oops, and if it eats its tail, it restarts the game. The goal is to get the pixel standing right there, and you can maneuver the snake with the mouse. All right. You can click to return to the top level menu, back to Pong, let it run on autoplay, and you can see the fabric panel is attached to the t-shirt by Velcro, so you can move it for other purposes. And if you peel off the cover panel containing the silver edging, you can see the workings of the fabric panel behind. Here is the Arduino lily pad, the power supply with a 
uh, lithium polymer battery and the joystick attached at the side. Um, it's a little easier to see with the cover panel on front. And that is the LED Matrix t-shirt. I hope you like it.